this. If you don't know what Ultra Hardcore is, it is Minecraft PvP where you don't regen health from hunger. Okay, I just got... Um, okay... Okay. Time to restart the intro. Very professional here. <laughs> That's a trademark. Okay. So this is Draft Crafters. Draft Crafters is a survival observer hosted by Wingnut, one of the participants in this Ultra Hardcore match. Uh, the others are also members of Draft Crafters. I'll leave a link to them so you can see some of the Draft Crafters good. Uh, yes, ultra hardcore. You don't read gen health from hunger, uh, only from golden apples, which are crafted with gold ingots, or health potions by using nether wart and a golden block and a melon for making glistering melons. That's about it. You can also see the health counter on this nifty menu. Not menu, or rather counter. And so we go. I spawned in snow biome, which is not very great, but you know what? Let's go with it. You have to take your chances, live with what you got, and make the best of it. That's Ultra Hardcore for you. Alright. As any ordinary Minecraft Let's Play, we craft. Isn't that exciting? Yes, okay. This is Draft Crafters Ultra Hardcore Season 0B. Uh, what you just uh, heard, uh, what you just watched before was Season 0A, which was um, a failed butchered attempt where things happened, things were broken, and people died. Yep. Fortunately, Scottish could not join us this time. Hopefully, it will next time. A freakle Napple. No, I'd rather not. Alright, we got a free golden apple then. Wow. I do not enjoy these strange rules. But you know what? Let's go with it. So that's the way of Ultra Hardcore. Okay. Time to stop talking about Ultra Hardcore. Um, what should I talk about next? Maybe you want to know more about the Draft Crafters. So, as I said, it's uh, hosted by Wingnut. It's a survival server where we just killed the Ender Dragon. That was pretty fun. Uh, we got Exit Online, or Specialty Geek, who is really overpowered and is very good at mining. Uh, we have uh, Kinako. He's a pretty cool guy, I think he's pretty chill. Uh, and Wingnut, yeah, Wingnut is Wingnut. What else can you say? I really enjoy playing with all of them, because they are pretty cool guys. Um, um, yeah, please check them out. They're better than me. You should not be watching me. Um, anyway, what should we talk about? This is a good start here. Squeeze drowning, yes. Minecraft is awesome like that. Isn't Minecraft just a great game? We got pegs with mean snouts. Yes. English is my second language. Would you have guessed? Oh, oh no, gotta go in the hour. Oh boy. Okay, let's finish this quick then. 20 minutes. Oh, oh boy. Well, this is gonna be rushed to all heck. Man. Even quicker, yeah. <laughs> Whoa, man. This is insane. 
Okay, this is gonna be a quick one. Quick. A quickie, you're, you're squeaky. Yep. Let's go and call it Ultra Hard Quick. And hit gold, hit gold, hit gold. Get the gold. Uh, yeah, so let's think, let's think here. I'm not great at ultra hardcore, so that's why I'm like really stressed out. Tell maybe by the way I'm moving around. So it's like, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. What should I do? Um, okay. I'm drawing a complete blank here. <gasps> did, did I just hear a skeleton? Pretty sure. Are, are my, uh, Ear eyes? I, I was just supposed to say ears. That would be really bad. Or weird. Or both. Okay. So, um. What other games do I play except Minecraft? Let's think. Uh, I do enjoy the PlayStation 2 a lot. Which is probably a nostalgic moment for me. Uh, because I played a lot. Uh, play some true games when I grew up, like SSX, the original SSX. Oh man, that's nostalgic. That's nostalgic for you. Oh, what spider spawner? Why would you go near a spider spawner? That seems very counterproductive. And oh, all at ten. Hey yo. Your point is. Nothing, you receive no extra points. You're the weakest link. Goodbye. What? Okay. Let's return to the action of not finding anything. And not finding anything is usually not productive. Yeah. So, let's see. Are there any special world events? Oh, yes. I guess we could talk about that. Okay. I am from Norway. And at uh, the time of this recording, the April 16th, this is the day, a very important day for Norwegian teenagers. Um, I'm going to give you a little hint on what. So there's this guy, which a lot of people love and a lot of people hate. But he, he keeps like singing about Babies and boyfriends? I never really understood it, but someone enjoys it. I'm gonna give you a second to figure it out. Just don't worry your heads too much, I will tell you, if you uh, haven't realized it yet. Yes, it is Justin Bieber. Justin Bieber has reached Norway and girls all over the country are going wild. Television channels are streaming non-stop. The fact that they covered him on the same level as the horrible event in Boston, which is much more important in my mind, it was covered on the same level. Bieber getting out of the airport is being covered at the same time as that event. I feel as bitter as uh, disrespectful, in my opinion. I don't really see the appeal of Beaver. Like, I feel it's just another part of our society and our world being more and more uh, celebrity centric. Oh, wow. I am not a talking person today. <laughs> yeah. But, uh, yeah, I've never really gotten or understood Beaver. Never understood believers, but again, I'm not a teenage girl, which is, um, I know that teenage, teenage boys who, um, enjoy Bieber too, but I'm not one of them, and I don't think I'll ever, ever will be, because honestly, when I first heard the song, Baby, probably the first song a lot of people heard, um, yeah, I did not like that. I thought it was, um... So it's like a high-pitched boy shouting about a baby. Oh, it's night. Oh, man. 
That was the timer, the PvP timer. Let's do remember. Okay, let's see. So now I have to do some typey type stuff. Region flag your C PvP allow. And say PvP is now on. There we go. Now people are going to die. Wow, exit. Now you change your mind. <laughs> too late, yeah. I'd say too late or not. Everyone's being given one. Huh? What? I thought I heard, just saw something. That's weird. Okay. But now it's time to get up. No, get down. Get down, get down, get down, get down. That's a weird song. Uh, what? Oh, bring that! Dun 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 dun! There's definitely action going with other people here. While well, I am crafting for my darn life. Exciting crafting action. <laughs> and a knockback too. Oh man. Let's get a bow then. <laughs> Oh man, this is good. I'm feeling good. No damage taken, and it's not. And I'm down here. And if I get in the cave, there's less uh, scary things in the dark. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Let's see what to do. What to do? Um. Yeah. So I talked about Bieber. Sorry about the horrible events in Boston, condol condolences, but that is not what this is about. Uh, this is about fighting and having fun at the same time. Um, yeah, food, Can't, don't know how to remember that. Got 10 minutes, oh boy, oh, exit, I, oh, Spazzy. Yeah, he wants to be called Spazzy, it's just, it's my girl's name. I'm trying to remember that. It's just so quick to just read the names, you know. Just oh, it's actually no, it's Bessie. Oh, and a cave, <gasps> and the ravine has been found, and that's my jingle. <gasps> Yay, iron! Fun times are had with iron. Minecraft is like a poem. Everyone is looking for the same thing. But what does what do you really achieve, achieve by killing others? What do you get out of that? I don't really know. Is it just for the heck of it? Is it for the fun of it? Is it some sort of sick thrill that people get out of it? Who knows? So that was really deep. <gasps> golden apple is being delivered. Dun 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 dun. It's a golden apple. And wait, it's a golden apple delivery system. Dun 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 dun. dun. Copyrighted song. Uh, here we go. <laughs> Things are going great in the draft crafters ultra hardcore. Apple. Apple. It's an apple. It's a yellow apple. But where's the blue apple? Where's the apple of Eden? That's what I want to know. Where's the religious deep context within the Assassin's Cults? Wow, that was a bad Assassin's Creed reference if, I, if I've heard one. <laughs> oh, jolly good. Jolly good. Jolly Roger. Oh yeah, Jolly Roger reminds me of Pirates of the Caribbean, and Pirate, and that's a weird phrase, or how to phrase Pirates of the Caribbean, um, yeah, 
but the new movie by the producers of Pirates of the Caribbean. The Lone Ranger. Um, I don't know. Just don't overuse it. I think that's okay. Yeah. But anyways, um, what was I talking about? I'm not going to use nearby way. I just want to play like a regular mm, uh, UG style affair type. I, I feel near is kind of cheating, but I'm going to lie. Snap. Oh, snap. Dun 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 And there's action. And there's lapis. Dun 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 dun. Where's the... Where's the guy? Where's the guy? Okay. I was gonna say, uh, I was talking about the Lone Ranger. I've been reading up on the Lone Ranger because it's uh, pretty much an American thing. And being European, I have little to no knowledge of American things. Except Bonanza and Cheers and everybody loves Raymond because that is syndicated to all heck and it's all over the world. It's a universal thing. Which is kind of funny because I think everybody loves Raymond was syndicated by uh, Universal Studios. If I am not mistaken. <gasps> wow, Spider Spiner. It's good. And Knockback too is good. Oh uh, boy. Uh, yeah, but the Lone Ranger, I think it started out as a radio show. That is a strange start. And now it's been turned from a radio show to a TV show, and a TV show to a movie, a feature movie, with Johnny Depp. If you had not enough Johnny Depp in Pirates of the Caribbean, join us next time for even more in this movie. Which is quite possible. Oh, I didn't even see a scout. And I kept F3 up. I'm so sorry. It's so un unprofessional. But I got him, at least. This is like. I don't feel like I'm commentating on the gameplay at all. It's like, oh, yeah, I got him. That's all. Let's keep moving. <laughs> oh, man. Wingnut is a silly, silly, silly wingnut. Yeah. Okay, the long ranger. No, long ranger? Are we talking about Goofy now or what? He's pretty long. Tall, I mean. The long ranger! That would be a nice t uh, TV show. The long ranger, tall as a giraffe. Tall ranger. Show us what you can. I don't, even, I don't even know. I just made a TV show in my own head. I am strange. Anyways. Yeah, but I feel like the, the this new adaption of the Lone Ranger probably won't be similar to what everyone knows as the Lone Ranger in the Americas. It will probably be very similar to Pirates of the Caribbean. But for people who like that, I think it's going to be a heck of a ride. It's going to be a good movie. 10 out of 10, 10 out of 10. If I would roll a dice on that movie, if you like pirates, you gonna, you like pirates? Okay, you're gonna like cowboys. Or the rangers. Texas rangers. <gasps> gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. We got go for days, go for days. We go, we go. No, we're not good, we're good. I don't even know what's going on with my axe today. Oh, it hit water. Okay. So, um, yeah, if you have any opinions on this new Lone Ranger, uh, maybe, um, has it been out in America? Maybe. Has it been out here, though, in the Norwegian lands? Oh, golly gosh. Oh, I put out the. Ah, uh, and then. Oh boy. <laughs> well, that was quick. <laughs> okay, but it's been good talking to you guys. <laughs> Thank you.
Please, uh, what's the other perspectives? <laughs> I think they will last a bit longer. <laughs> oh, that was fun. Alright, I'll talk to you guys later. Peace out. And jump! Bye!